10 Tampa Bay is your hurricane headquarters. There's more activity out in the tropics tonight. Let's get right over to meteorologist Mike Pringley for the latest. Yes, well, we've got the calm after the storm pattern here at home. Beautiful weather, but unfortunately it is peak week in the tropics. And what we're watching here is that peak of our graph reaching yes, the pinnacle September 10th. And I know the last thing we want to talk about is the tropics uh, post Adalia. But as we take a look at the big picture, the good news is no concerns anytime soon close to home. But there are two waves we are watching. We call this the African wave train. Notice we've got some thunderstorms really flaring up and two strong waves that are expected to cross the Atlantic. Really the lead wave is the one I'm going to watch carefully that could come close to Puerto Rico as we head into next weekend. All right, so we've got time to watch this, but we'll have much more on this and I'll have all your spaghetti models, but let's celebrate what we have. Seize the day, right? I mean, this is the weather we've all been asking for really since May or June, and you can see why it's 89, but that dew point is 67, feeling oh so good. That relative humidity at 48%. Our grill out forecast, yeah, we're cooking up a good forecast for you. Check this out. Temperatures actually falling nicely with that lower humidity down to 80 degrees at 10 o'clock. Nothing to slow you down, but something to stay tuned for. All eyes on these temperatures. They may be close to 90 now, but we're looking for our coolest night since June.